All right, good morning, class. We're gonna do French folk song today. And you guys all have your music out for it, right? So we're gonna turn to it right now. Can anybody tell me anything about what you see when you look at the music? Anybody? Yes, Timmy, you see three, four, what does that mean? So you know how all the other music we've been playing has had four beats to a measure, right? Now we're only going to have three beats to a measure. And what that means is our bow directions are going to be very, very wonky. To demonstrate that, I'm going to play the first two measures. And I want you guys to count along with me. So you're going to go one, two, three, one, two, three. Ready? One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Anybody notice something with my bow directions? Yeah, it was backwards on the second measure. So I'm gonna play three notes and I want you to look where my bow starts and ends. Yeah, so I started my bow by the frog. I played one note, went to the tip, played the second note, went back to the frog, played the third note and went back to the tip. And then the next measure, the first beat, I will go up to the frog and back to the tip and up to the frog. This is different than what we've done in the past because in the past, if we wanted to play three notes, we probably would have gone, done this. And then reset. Reset. But we're not gonna do that because we're gonna be fancy and we're just gonna keep the bow on the string while playing. So the first two measures will look like this. Alrighty, so next what we're going to do is going to have get out your instruments and let me know when you're ready. Alright, so we're gonna play a D, which is which is what finger on the A string? Three, yes. And you're gonna play with me. We're gonna go down, up, down. Alright? Everybody on a D? And one, ready, go. Down, up, down. Now everybody lift up the third finger, so you're playing a C sharp, and then we're gonna go up down, up. Ready, go. Up, down, up. Good, now go to a B and go down, up, down. And then open to your A string and just do three beats of an A on your open A string. Ready, go. One, two, three. Very good, very good. Alrighty, now we're going to look at the music. And we're going to play the first four measures with me. Ready? Everybody ready? One, two, three, one, ready, go. everybody and on the next measure we're going to a G. Can anybody tell me what string and what fingering the G is going to be on? It's going to be on our D string third finger. So if we walk up the D string we go D, E, F sharp, G. That's going to be our next note. Everybody start on that note and we're going to play the next two measures, G, 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 F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, E, 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 D. Alrighty, don't lift up your bows, guys. Starting on the down bow. Ready, go. G, 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 F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, E, 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 D, two, three. Good job, guys.
that. Okie dokie. Now we're going to work on our tunneling between an A and a G real quick. Really quickly, we're just going to review how we're going to start on the D. Or I'm sorry, we're going to start on open A. And then go immediately to G. So you're going to play an A, down bow A, stop, up bow, G. And we're going to pause between and make sure review our checkpoints. So ready, go. A, two, three, pause, tunnel, one, two, three on the D string. So you're having a G. Rotate your bow and play your G. Ready, go. G. Very good. We gotta make sure our tunnels are in order before we can do anything else. Alrighty. Now we're gonna start on the measure uh, letter B, alright? This is just simply on a D string. Open one, two, open one, two, open one, two, three. Everybody ready? One, two, three, one, two, ready, go. Everybody's got to make sure we do full bows because if we don't do full bows, we don't have a full sound. If we don't have a full sound, we don't sound the best, all right? So we're going to do that again, slower, with a fuller bow. Okay, one, two, three. <laughs> On the D string, we're gonna go one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, open on the A string, okay? Everybody with me? One, two, three. Very good string crossing, guys. And then from open, we're gonna go to a high D. So to practice that real quick, we're just gonna play an open A and then put all three of our fingers down slowly. So everybody play an open A with me. Let's try that again. Now place all three fingers down and play a D. walk around to my students and check if they're doing it right. Do that for a little. Then we're going to go back and we're going to apply that to letter C. So we're going to play C and then we're going to we're going to play the first note of D and hold it out, all right? So we're going to go E F sharp G E, F sharp, G, E, F sharp, G, A, two, three, D, and hold it, all right? One, two, three. Very good. And now from D, we're gonna just going to do our D scale that we've been practicing. Everybody should, should have been practicing. We're going to go D scale, and we're going to go all the way down to D. And then we're going to go D, E, D. Just a little, little fun, um, fun note put on the end. Just going to repeat D. So everybody, we're going to play it at letter D, and we're going to play the four bars. Ready? And one, two, three. We've done everything by section. We made sure our tunnels are correct. We made sure our string crossings are correct. We made sure our up our bow never never resets. So for the first three measures, we're going down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, two, three, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, two, three, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, two, three, up, down, up, 
down, up, down, up, down, up, down, two, three, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, two, three. Have more time, I would have the students do that with me. But for now, we're just gonna play the first half of this piece, never resetting our bows, making sure our tunnels are correct, our string crossings are correct, our pitch, our tuning, all that jazz, and we're gonna go for it. All right, class, beginning. One, two, three, one, ready, go.